Hey guys, this is Aku, and here are my thoughts on Robocough introducing a new brand, Insta Relief. 40 doses per bottle. So, what is one dose? 50 milligrams. 50 times 40. That is 2,000 milligrams in a single bottle. What if a DPH addict just drinks a whole bottle and dies because it's a lethal dose? You should reduce that size. Honestly, you should reduce that size to a, under a gram, preferably 900 milligrams. That is, that is somewhat irresponsible what you're doing. Like, come on. I mean, unlike the DPH pills, you'd have to like deal with the hardness of the how oh, it just goes through your throat and just, it's irritating. But this makes DPH abuse easier. I don't approve this. If you're gonna sell DPH, don't go make two grams, which is a lethal dose, in a single bottle. Like, that's irresponsible, I'm sorry. That is irresponsible. Unlike the Robocough bottle, which only has 1,200 milligrams of DXM, which times 0.7, which is how you get the free base dose. That's 840 milligrams free base compared to 2 grams diphenhydramine in a single bottle. For reference, the following is said about DXM. Now, health issues start to arise, guaranteed, at over 1.5 grams. So you'd have to take two bottles in order to start seeing health issues if you're not careful enough or take too much or whatever and may land you to the hospital. <laughs> but one bottle of this can kill you! One bottle can kill you, I don't like this. This is not cool. So, here are my final, my final thoughts. You either reduce that to 900 milligrams, or I will tell everyone not to buy this bottle and to go find a different seller of diphenhydramine for medicinal purposes. Because I'm not going to let this company go kill someone so easily. Unlike how much, like, unlike Robocough, you know how hard Robo tablets is to swallow? Yeah, sure. That it is two times the threshold for where health issues persist. For reference, there are three grams of dextromethorphan free base in a single Robo tablets bottle. But they're so salty and gross. Unlike this, this is, it's like soda compared to, it's like, so Robo tablets are like swallowing chalk. And then this, this is like swallowing soda compared to that. Yeah, don't, don't do this. Come on, Insta Relief. I believe in you. I believe. Robocop, I believe that you can do better and not go and just sell easily fatal bottles like that. Okay, that's all my thoughts. Actually, before I say bye, I have a personal message to the owner of Robocop. I believe in your product. I love your company. I think you can do better though. I don't want your bottle to easily cause people to go into comas have permanent brain damage like memory loss, aphasia, hallucination, persisting perception disorder, depression, lack of empathy, and death over a single bottle. I believe that you can be more responsible and practice better harm reduction and not go sell a single bottle for two grams. I will still continue to support the Robocough brand, but consider me out of the Insta Relief brand. Mostly because I'm actually 690 days and over free from DPH use, even from medicinal use. 
Yeah, you heard me. I have not taken diphenhydramine in a medicinal nor overdose dose in over 1.89 years. <laughs> I'm proud of myself for that. I'm very proud of myself. Feels like a great milestone not to be go abusing antihistamines and having a better brain that doesn't have brain fog. Oh yeah, that's another side effect of DPH, brain fog. Okay, now for reals, I gotta get going. But I wanna see progress for with harm reduction from you, Robocop and its owners. Okay, bye-bye.